Let me update you on the situation at Ash Manor, Ash Green. By the way, this has nothing to do with Ash Manor School in Tongham. Following our well-attended silent protest on the 18th of May, the Council's planning officers pulled the Ash Manor application from the agenda of the planning meeting on the 20th of May due to the weighty documents received from AGRA. The original application, 18P02456, and the new duplicate application, 20P01461, were then scheduled in the agenda for Wednesday the 16th of June. This was not ideal for us, as our two ward councillors were away on annual leave. Shortly before the planning meeting, the applications were pulled again from the agenda. This time, due to reports received by the GBC tree officer, who has now changed his mind over the status of the veteran oak tree. These documents are between one and three years old, but contained all the information provided to him in objections from AGRA and Surrey Wildlife Trust. He says that he can confirm that because of its age and now size, and because it already has sufficient veteran features, that in accordance with the NPPF, the oak tree T67 does in fact qualify as a veteran tree and should be protected accordingly. AGRA have also recently applied to GBC for an injunction on the tree, but were refused. We are now being informed that the planning officer is recommending to refuse the 18P2456 application on the grounds of the tree only. This means that we still will have to present a case on the heritage, the drainage and the breaches to the local plan. The duplicate application will go before the planning inspector in September and we, AGRA, are going to attend having been accepted as a Rule 6 party. Rule 6 is for interested parties involved in an inquiry. But we need the funds to do this, and this is where we need your support. We need to pay for a barrister, a heritage expert and a drainage expert. We have received some donations through our GoFundMe page already, and for this we thank you and we have also received some generous donations via cheques. Details for donating to our bank account for those not comfortable using GoFundMe will be displayed on the screen. The developers are relying on our lack of funds to railroad through changes which will destroy this part of England's history for good. Please give us your backing, so with your help, we villagers can win against the might of the developers. Please donate what you can. It will be much appreciated and will make a difference. Thank you.